What is up, everyone, and welcome back to Crack and Packs MTG. We're going to roll back the clock a few months, and we're going to open a Lord of the Rings Tales of Middle-Earth Special Edition Collector Booster Box. That was a mouthful, and this one is for my Facebook group member and homie, Chucky Bear. We're going to see if we can get him a dope poster card, a serialized, you know the drill. And at the end of the video, we'll be giving away our Markov Booster Box for the new release. So make sure you guys are subscribed, you're commenting on these videos. That way, you guys can get in on these giveaways. But without further ado, we'll let the, the pack will open here. Without further ado, let's open this pack for Chucky. Willowind, Berserker, Lorian Revealed. That is the, the marquee common of the set. Forest, Gandalf. Nice little hit with a halfling. Galadriel's Dismissal. Battle of Bywater. Make some piles here. They'll end up a mess by the end of the video, but we'll do what we can. Ooh! And a Surge Foil, Redhorn Pass, and Attempt with Discovery. Good pack here. We'll go ahead and sleeve that Surge Foil. What did they call those? Realms and Relics, I think is what they were called. Correct me if I'm wrong on that, but these packs are heck to open. All right, pack number two for Chucky here. Faramir, Banished from Adorus, Treason of Isengard, Bitter Downfall, Shadow Summoning, Surge Foil Plains, and now for the hits, we have Trap the Trespassers, Faramir, Menace Morgul Dark Fortress. Palanthir of Ornthak in Surge Foil. Nice hit there. Ooh, huge hit with the Surge Foil. Legolas is quick. Reflexes. Sheesh. And then an Elvis Harfinger to end the pack. What a pack, guys. What a pack. Can you imagine if we get a, a one ring and a, a, and a serialized in here, too? Let's make it happen. Let's do it. Brandywine Farmer. Skipping a card there. Elrond. Swarming of Moria. Isolation. Ugluk of the White Hand. Farmir. Mountain. Windswift Slice. Arwen. Weaver of Hope. Searing Light. Elvin Chorus. Brandy Book. And Aragorn, the Uniter. Nice hit here. Mythic poster. Sheesh. The box, it keeps boxing. What is going on? Or maybe this set was just a lot better than we thought it would be. Everybody was like, do we really need a second Lord of the Rings? And uh, I think it turns out maybe we did. Because I think I, honestly, I, other than the big one of one chase out of the other set, I, I think I prefer this set more than that one. Rise of the Witch King. Fog of the Barrow Downs. Ranger's Firebrand. There's an island. Fateful Strike. Treebeard. Courageous Resolve. The Call of the Ring. In search foil, that is a very nice rare hit. Gandalf and a Souls Attendant there. Honestly, I don't know what I'm doing these piles anymore. I'm just putting cards in places. Like like this guy. Why is Gandalf all by himself there? We don't know. Let's let's do some housekeeping and we'll get right back to it. But uh what are we? Three or four? Four packs in? Solid box. Very solid box. We like what's going on here. Um, we got to get a Bowmaster at least, though, right? Where's the Orcish Bowmaster? I don't feel like it's it's Lord of the Rings without a Bowmaster. Come on, give us a Nazgul or something. Many Partings. Nimble Hobbit. First rare upcoming after the Search for the Land. We have the Scavenger. Taunt from the Rampart. Another quick reflexes. Box is going ham. Shagrat, Gandalf, Treebeard, 
and food. I, I've given up all hope on piles. So they're just probably all going right there. We'll figure it out later. But uh, so far for Chucky, this box is a banger. Oath of the Grey Host. Torment of Gollum. Westfold. We got the guest. Samwise. Tempest. King of the Oathbreakers. And Ramas Echor Ancient Shield in Surge Foil with a myriad landscape. Cool pack. Even if the pack doesn't have like the big hitters in it, like just the flavor of the set and the art style of the cards still make them extremely fun to open. Coral's End. Denethor. Dundan Rangers. Porter. Morgul Lieutenant. That was one of my favorite cards in this limited. Planes and Doors of Durin. Captain. Garrison. Flowering of the White Tree. Beautiful card. Samwise. And another one. This one is Hammerheim or Capital of Rohan. Box is winding down here. We have, oh, we, we got a good bit. This is, we got five left counting one of my hands. I was just like, man, we've got to be almost done with this one. All the hits we've already gotten. But no, but wait, there's more. Inherited Envelope, Prince of the Fair, Quarrel's End, The Grey Haven. So what do you guys think? Do you guys like the original Lord of the Rings set or this one better? Ooh, there's our Nazgul and it's a shiny one. Aragorn, Ramas, the Watcher in the Water, Surge Foil, Frodo, and just an Explorer there. And what upcoming sets are you looking forward to? Um, I know here in a couple weeks we're going to have Fallout. That seems like it's going to be super popular. I guess it's going to depend on how the, the collector boosters are laid out. We know the, the commander decks are going to go crazy. Um, but the, the, the collector boosters, I feel like... I don't know. I don't, I don't I don't have any inside information. But I feel like the collector boosters are going to be laid out a bit like the Doctor Who ones. And the commons and uncommons are going to be more rare than the mythics and rares. That's just kind of what I'm thinking. Stu the Conies. Rosie Cotton. Pippin. Lash of the Balrog. Old Man Willow. Forest. Press the Enemy. Spiteful Bandit Tree. Um, this was one of the most popular cards when the set released. People uh, gave it a pet name called the Heat Hook Massacre. Felby Shriek. Forge Anew. Elrond. Oh, it's a Gandalf the White. Double tapping the posters, baby. Let's go. Nice box. And, and you know, I've always got to look to see if there's a serial number on these because the, the art on them is so wonky. But, but I think they usually have that super glossy coating if you do hit a cereal. So it should stand out. But I always got to, you know, got to double check. Got to hope and pray. Got to do that, do that second scan to see if we get there. But uh, this has been a good box, especially for no one ring and no Orcish Bone Master so far. Good box all together. Elven Course, Riders of the Mark, Display of Power. Golem, sheesh, Pact of Negation, what is going on? Well, you know, sometimes you, you don't get what you want, but you get what you need. And uh, this, box is, this box is giving us beef. Glorified, I said glorified as Glorfindel. <laughs> Uh, what's wrong with me today? Swamp. Saruman, the White Hand. Balrog of Moria. Narsil Reforged. Horn of the Mark. Courageous Resolve. And a Myriad Landscape. All right, Chucky, last pack. Box has been hella solid so far, but let's see if we can go out with a bang or a whimper. Hopefully... We're going to be closing this one out with a sheesh.
Spearmaster, Westfold Riders, Fell Beast, Path Song. Here we go. <laughs> We're going home with a prize pig. Ambush, Gandalf of the Secret Fire. Radagast. All right, one last chance at glory, and it is a warship. Very pretty card. Um, very pretty card. We'll take it. We'll take it. Well, guys, thank you for joining me. I'm going to announce a giveaway right after this for the uh, Carla Manor Booster Box. Chucky, thank you for letting me do this. Uh, good box. We didn't get any of the super big hits, but the uh, two reflexes, some of these other cards, the pack the negation, seems like a super solid box. But uh, love you guys. Uh, love your faces, and we'll catch you in the next one.